Hello, I'm Ted Clayton. I'm the Energy and Power Management Services Program Manager for Command Industrial Technologies. Today we want to illustrate the energy savings of two different control methods for some equipment that's quite likely in your plant. When there are flow control systems, it's a very common practice to utilize mechanical devices to control the flow. We're going to show you the energy required to do that. And then I want to offer an illustration of the energy savings that comes if you directly control the speed of the fan to match the flow you require in your application. So we'll start with a mechanical flow control scenario. And we want to look at how much energy it takes to deliver about 2,000 CFM of air. So the fan's producing about 2,000 CFM of air. The energy required to do that is about 72%. The fan speed is at 100%. You notice the air volume, and you can hear that it's fairly loud. Now an alternative to this method is to change the speed of the motor, remove the mechanical flow control device, and if we now contrast this operating mode, we find still at about 2,000 CFM of air, the energy has dropped to around 22%. This fan speed is at 50%. And that really illustrates the control method and the benefit to direct control of the motor speed. This particular variable speed drive is from Emerson Control Techniques. And it includes an optimization feature that can further tune the system to reduce the energy consumption. If I turn that feature on, we see the energy consumption has dropped from about 22 to about 11 or 12, so another 10 points in reduction. So this is a very common opportunity across a variety of industries, commercial buildings, industrial buildings, supply fans, exhaust fans, even dust collectors, cooling towers, and your pumping systems are quite likely variable torque applications centrifugal devices that can benefit from this control mode. So if you look into your plant, look for the mechanical flow controls, and know that you have an option to drive significant energy savings, lower noise, this is much quieter, there's also reduced maintenance, and greenhouse gas emission reductions go along with the retrofit. So thank you.